Hey creative friends, well today I am trying blue jeans with the diode laser and I just did 100% power, uh, one pass, it worked just fine. So I'm going to bump that down to 80% and make sure that it would still cut at a lower uh, power. So here goes 80% power and 200, uh, let's see, 80% power at 200 millimeters per minute and I'm using light burn. It looks like that cut just fine. <clears throat> it did get a little smoky, um, but let's make sure that that... Uh, there's one little fiber there holding that on. So yeah, you might want to stick with 100%. But anyway, there you go. So that's 80% and 100% at... Yeah, that 100% is a little bit cleaner cut. Um, fairly heavyweight denim uh, blue jeans. And so that was, you know, 100% 100% power, 80% power. And I did both of them at 200 millimeters per minute. Okay, so I just finished cutting out another blue jean pattern like my last video to make a, a small little square notebook. And so I used that same setting there, the 100%, um, and just one pass. It had started at a slower speed. I had it set wrong, so it may stick right here, but um, it does look like it's going to lift up pretty, pretty well. There's a few spots there that are still holding. You know, it's very difficult to get it to lay perfectly flat, so that probably had something to do with it. And that one little corner, I need to just clip clip that real quick. But all in all, I think the uh, diode laser also does great for cutting um, denim. I'll do one quick test for it engraving, but uh, these cotton fibers just get destroyed with engraving. But I'll do one quick test here in just a second. Okay, I will show you some settings that did not work for the engraving on blue jeans, and that'll give you a ballpark where to shoot from. You definitely wouldn't want to go lower in power. There where it says image, I tried the 300 millimeters per minute uh, at 50% power, um, and it, the engraving just totally did not work whatsoever. I thought it was going to look pretty decent, but once I start to pick it up, You'll notice that those fibers, it just destroyed them. It just destroyed it completely. So it was supposed to be a cute little gnome. Um, you can kind of see the image left behind there, but it just disintegrated. So uh, much too powerful uh, for the engraving and much too uh, fast. I'm, I'm impatient, so I wanted to try to engrave fast, and so I bumped the speed up and the power up. But if you're, if you're patient, just... Um, Gives you something to shoot for. Definitely uh, don't do what I did. <laughs> um, and then hopefully you'll find some settings. Again, cotton fibers are going to be very, very difficult to engrave. I've seen many people here lately engraving and polyester um, materials. So I'm going to try that next. Um, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more experiments and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks a bunch.